Jennifer Hudson is granted restraining order against fiancé David Atunga. Jennifer Hudson has been granted a restraining order against David Atunga, her fiancé of 10 years after months of ending their relationship. The news was reported by People on Thursday after which a representative for the Dream Girls actress released a statement revealing news of the protective order she took out in interest of their eight-year-old son David Daniel Latunga Jr. In the confirmation, the star said revealed today, Jennifer requested and received a protective order against her ex-fiancé. Jennifer's actions are solely taken in the best interest of their son. Following Hudson's statement, Atunga, who used to be a professional wrestler then came out with a statement of his own as his attorney Tracy Rizzo told TMZ that Jennifer requested the order because she fears losing access to her son. The statement read, David Atunga has been trying to negotiate the terms of an amicable parenting agreement with Ms. Hudson for several weeks now. However, when it became apparent to Ms. Hudson that Mr. Atunga would be the parent granted residential care of the child as a result of Mr. Atunga being the child's primary caregiver while Ms. Hudson pursues her career all over the world. Ms. Hudson decided to file a meritless petition for order of protection in an effort to gain an unfair advantage in the custody dispute. Hudson has continued to work consistently and will next appear in the crime drama Monster, which is now his post-production. She has a recurring role on the voice. Things then got somewhat ugly, with Rizzo adding that Jennifer's real motives for requesting the order of protection were petty in nature. He went on, as a result of Mr. Atunga's career in the we, Ms. Hudson felt that she could give an award-winning performance in court to portray herself as the victim. Mr. Atunga has never abused or harassed Ms. Hudson or their son. Jennifer and David got engaged in 2008 after a little less than a year of dating. Earlier this year, Jennifer revealed David saved her life in 2009 when her mother, Donna Aldenison, and brother, Jason Hudson, were shot in Chicago, while her seven-year-old nephew, Julian King, was found dead in the back seat of a car. Had she not been spending time being David, with whom she had become engaged shortly before, as she was planning to visit her mother, but stayed with her fiancé instead. She told Ebony magazine, that's one of the things that saved my life, because I could have been home with my mom then, David wanted me to come out to Florida with him instead of going to Chicago. I flew out to see him, that's why I'm still here. I've never said that before, and I can't believe I just said that now. But I didn't know. He was just like, I'm going to this wrestling thing, and it's in Tampa. I'm going out there now, so you can come out there and see me versus going home.